Is there any questions? Let me let me let me throw preach out. To the the preach to the Christians. Don't preach to the Muslims. I'll okay. preach to whoever I want, and you can't stop me. Try. Okay. So who ruled the earth when Christ died for three days? I'm sorry. He believes in the Trinity. Who ruled the earth when Christ died for three days, according to the Christian belief? Christ did. How can you when you're dead according to your belief? What do, you don't even know what I believe, do you? Tell me what you believe. Thank you very much. There we go. That's a much more intelligent question. What do you believe? Not telling me what I believe. So let me tell you what I believe, sir. What I believe is what the scriptures teach in the books of Pe in the letters of Peter, that Christ died in his humanity. Me. One second, no. I let like me to finish. Take, I like to think. Let me finish my answer, sir. Don't get angry. Let him speak as well. Practice some manners. Okay, have practice have some speak. manners. You ask the question, at least have the dignity to listen okay. to the answer. Yeah. So, what does the Council of Ephesus teach? This is what our church fathers teach about the crucifixion. The divine does not die. Did you all hear that, Muslims? Yeah. The divine does not die. Okay. So the divine of the Son of God did not die upon the cross. Only Thank his fleshly body. That's all the time and so Christ was still ruling the world. Excuse me, sir. Go on. According to the Gospel of Barnabas, and I shall tell you who Barnabas was. Don't be rude was. to your brother. Barnabas is mentioned in the in the remaining four books of the New Testament as a prince among men, as a king, as a, as a good person. And he said that in the Garden of Gethsemane, when Judas was supposed to have embraced Jesus to show the soldiers for 20 pieces of silver who Jesus was, there was a hue and a tumult and a cry in the Garden of Gethsemane and they all surrounded the two embraces. And according to the Gospel of Barnabas, who in the other four books is mentioned as a prince, a king among men, the person who was crucified was the person who was taken from there. And according to the Gospel of Barnabas, it was Judas Iscariot who was crucified. And that is why he said, forgive them, Father, for they know not what they do. May I reply? Please okay. Go. So he quotes the Gospel of Barnabas. If you are a Christian here, put your hand up if you recognize the Gospel of Barnabas because as being authentic. i tell you why. No, no, sir. Allow me to reply. Oh, please do. Allow me to reply. Please do. No Christian accepts the Gospel of Barnabas. Why? Let me have reply, sir. Calm yourself. Discipline your heart. Practice some manners. Quoting the Gospel of Barnabas to me is like me trying to quote the Hare Krishna book the Bhagavad Gita to a Muslim and to argue to the Muslim of using the Bhagavad Gita. That's not true. Everyone, everyone, notice they can't be quiet. Everyone, one second, sir. One, one question at a time. Let him speak. One question at a time. He's spoken. Let him speak. Using arguments from the Gospel of Barnabas are irrelevant to me. I don't even feel I need to answer them. However, because he brought me up, let me just say a few words about the Gospel of Barnabas. Dr. Bruce Metzger, Dr. Bart Ehrman, Dr. Daniel Wallace, some of the leading scholars of biblical criticism, all consider the Gospel of Barnabas to be a late forgery written in Italy after the 7th century. Well, in other words, well, no one in the academic world right. believes that it is a first century document. They all believe that it was a forgery by Muslims written at the time when Muslims were occupying areas of the Italian peninsula. No, 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 no. And we know it's no. a forgery no, no, no. because it gets its geography wrong. No, you are talking lies. It gets its geography wrong. It talks about things that are real in the 7th century as if they were true in the 1st century. No real historian takes the Gospel of Barnabas seriously. You, sir, have been misinformed by Muslims who have lied to you because they themselves have been lied to.